is all volume, it is all pressure. She truly fights like she is double parked outside. All right, just about ready for live action. Here is tonight's tale of the tape. Both fighters are 35 years old. Herring will have a one inch reach advantage. And now for the particulars, here's Bruce Ladies Buck. and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC bantamweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. A mixed martial artist holding professional record of 14 wins, 10 losses. She stands five feet, five inches tall, weighing in at 115 pounds. Fighting out of Crystal Lake, Illinois, Felice Lil Bulldog Harry. And now introducing her opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This woman is a Muay Thai fighter holding a professional record of 14 wins, 12 losses. She stands five feet three inches tall, weighing in at 115 pounds, fighting out of San Diego, California, Angela Overkill Hill. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Eve Levine. The veteran Eve Levine draws the assignment here. You ready? You ready? Fight. All right, fight clock is moving. We are now underway. It's going to be interesting to see how this fight stylistically plays out between a true striker against a well-rounded. This is a big-time fight field. People have been planning for this matchup for a really long time. They wanted to see how the striker would handle someone that would try to force them into uncomfortable situations. Let's see how this thing plays out. Back to her feet now. Good sign for her there. Hill gets caught with that punch. All right, so there's that kick to the leg, and you can be sure she's going to go back to the well with that. She's beating up that lead leg. That what a fantastic wrestler. Great takedown. Oh, that's a beautiful escape and reversal by her there. Unbelievable sweep. She did a fantastic job of manipulating the weight to change the position. All right, nice transition into full guard. If you're the top fighter, where do you go from here? Try to posture up, get some big ground and pound off, which will lead to you passing the half guard. Just over three minutes to go, round one. Oh, right to the mount. Oh, nice job by her there. You see how strong she is. Her opponent's trying to control posture, unable to do so. Now she can get to work and put the money in the bank with that ground and pound. Money in the bank. There is just a viciousness with which she operates here on the ground as she continues to get the ground and pound game going. She might get a finish here. She's looking for the finish. She's so good at dictating these ground exchanges, and she's doing a fantastic job of building posture to try to land that kill shot at the top. Trying to set up a submission now. in that last round, DC. I know you don't have a telestrator, but take us through the review. I mean, I would love to have my telestrator right now. That was a great display of high-level mixed martial arts striking. Both combatants stood toe-to-toe -to -toe and let it all hang out. All 
All right, DC, the next round is underway. She landed a high number of total strikes in the previous round and figures to pick up where she left off. She better pick up where she left off. She needs to keep the pressure high. Her opponent is already starting to slow down. You can see the damage starting to take effect as they get ready to begin this next round. What a body kick. Just missed on the front kick there. All right, so she goes for the double leg takedown here, DC, and she is able to secure it. Beautifully done there. Beautifully done. Great timing, great angle on the finish. Great job getting to her best position. Both fighters get up now. Oh! Oh, nice high kick. She misses Great with the back punch there. Get that take down. Oh, and with conviction, she moves right into half guard. Without much effort, she was able to pass from her full guard right into half guard. Uh, when you get in a bad spot on the ground and you want to reverse it, that's what you need to do. Master class in changing position, unreal to see. Hill's going for a choke. Oh, wow, oh! Just be a matter of time. <laughs> and there it is. Wow. Wow. <laughs> yeah, really nice job by her there to execute the submission. Clearly, she had an opening and she closed the show pretty effectively there. That is one of the bigger wins of her UFC career. So there she is, your winner by way of submission. That's a finish they'll be talking about for some time. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Leving has called a stop to this contest at two minutes, 45 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by tap out, Angela Overkill Hill. Well, it'll be standing room only at her after party tonight as she gets it done by way of submission. Thankfully, Daniel Cormier uh, is on the list. I'll be on the outside looking. I mean, John, I got you. We're going in together. <laughs> I'm not going in without my partner. But, man, she's a great grappler. She understands positioning so well. And she knows the moment her opponent got out of position, she was able to attack her finish. Great job, great performance. I don't have enough words to say congratulations.